Today we're on the hunt for some squid. We're on the kayak. Let's get out there. Let's chuck some jigs out. Bang. Yes. There is a we find a massive school of salmon, which converts into some abalone, and let's have an adventure. What a beautiful morning, guys. Look at that just behind me. Sun's up, crystal clear water. There's already some kayakers out there. But we are back, baby. We're gonna chase some squid on the kayak solo. And we've got our two rods, one of a float. Start off with one of these, safety first. We're gonna take our wheels off. If they come off. Take all the sand off the wheels. Sweet. Just gonna whack it just in here. Let's get in the water, shall we? Quickly put our, probably might not even need the buddy, the paddle for now. As long as I whack this in quickly, then we'll be sweet. Let's roll. You beauty. We're out in the water, which is amazing. I haven't been out here on the kayak for a long time. In fact, fishing for squid. Uh, haven't been out for quite a while now. So we're out, perfect conditions, solo and the goal today is to brain them. Nah. Our goal is today to get a, a nice bag of southern calamari. We just got some white jigs on to start off with, but I'm very excited because I've finally got the perfect squid net. Look at that, extension handle. So it's a nice fixed extension handle for the kayak just to scoop those squid up. Rubber mesh, full black, can't go wrong from Inky Squid Tackle. So I'm gonna put that here for now. And we're going to test it out on some squid. Let's go get some. Just going to whip that out just there. Probably about 10 meters in front of the kayak. And while that's sinking down, we've got a smaller white jig, size three on a float. And uh, that's just going to be hanging just uh, behind the kayak, just in case there's some followers or Something like that. Looks like the tide's still coming in, so I'm drifting towards this way. So what I'm gonna do, just reverse and go slowly while my jigs are sinking through the water column. That's another very effective way to get squid. You're gonna love those morning swimmers. My bad, unfortunately, I wasn't watching where I was going and uh, the float rig went straight in the prop. Let's just take a pause for a moment and appreciate how clear that water is. That is stunning. Doesn't get much better than that. Time to find some new ground. Can you believe it, not even one squid? Really? Yeah, when it was running in and now it's running out. I fished a tide change and for nothing. Can you believe it? It's probably like three knots if that. Oh yeah, it's glassed out, but with a tiny, tiny bit of breeze, which is good. Yeah. Sun's out completely, no clouds, but f all squid. Boy, I got a squid on. It's been a long morning, I can tell you that, guys. Not one squid, now hooked up, and look what we got. A small cuttlefish, can you believe it? <laughs> on the white, gonna scoop him up. Yes, first creature in the net. <laughs> Look at that. 
Now that is some good whiting bait. Look at that thing. Oh, good thing is, look at that. Clean net, thanks to that rubber there. Rubber mesh, that goes in there. And that's our nice little cuttlefish. Been about a couple of hours now. It's literally a tire change now, so we should get some squid, but I'll clean him up so ink doesn't go everywhere, but got a nice little cuttlefish. Not bad, now we just need to get some squid. After an exhausting morning, it's time for some energy. It's this flavor, it's uh, raspberry lemonade. Let's give that a go. Not bad. I think we're just gonna move up a bit. It is completely dead here, and if you can catch a cuttlefish but you can't catch a squid, that tells you something and there's not much squid around. So it's literally a tie change now. So you should be, well, I should be getting quite a few squid. So what I'm gonna do is just move up, cover some more ground, hopefully we get a nice patch of them. After a very tough morning, we bump into our mate Gary, and then we're on. About time we've got summon. <laughs> and it is tiny, guys. The smallest squid you ever see. He's got no followers either. Oh, yes he, yes he does, yes he does. He does have a follower. So watch this, I got that in there. Now what I'm gonna do is just leave that like that. I'm gonna put my jig just in there. He already shot off. That tells you they're not feeding hard. So, got that little guy in there. He's a bit bigger than what I thought, which is all right. Well, his mate definitely went off, and uh, we've got our squid in the net. So, as you can see, a nice little squid. Thought he was gonna be a bit smaller, the way it was coming up on the surface. But just a nice little squid there. Awesome colors to him. Sun's out, high in the sky, 30 degrees. I'm actually getting cooked. Oh, look at that, nice little squid. We're gonna head in now. It's probably one of the quietest sessions I've ever had on the squid. It is pretty hot weather today. So we got one squid and a cuttlefish. Just quickly while I've got it, the moment of truth. Let's see if this net floats or sinks. All right, ready? Look at that, it floats. So just in case you drop it off the kayak, bang. That ain't going nowhere. Not only that, this is gonna be awesome for my uh, trout fishing in the streams and stuff like that too. Oh yeah. All right guys, we're gonna head in now. A very slow morning, but we're gonna get in the water. Spear fishing, haven't, been, haven't done that for a while now. Let's get into it. All right guys, we're gonna go for a dive now. Shelby and James just on the camera there. Have a look at this, got the drone up. There is a whole school of salmon. Have a look at, have a look at that guys. I'll go down a bit. I don't wanna to go too down because I'll scare them. But look at that. They are big boys too. Let's get the gear on and let's get into them. All right, we're just gonna go in now. Just gonna go with the uh, bottom bit on. This part's way too tight and it's gonna be 30 something degrees today, so it's not gonna be worth it. Just got my dive gear ready and let's get out there. I just saw Flatty having sex with a banjo shark.
cold. I'm going to get out and grab that as a crab. 